Hey guys, how you all doing? It's PJ coming to you from Addicted to Grow, and I'm just stoked about this little mind brain fart that I just wanted to share with you all. The heading of my title today is, Your Feelings Are Your Reactions. So, what I want you to think about is this. No one can actually make you feel a certain way. If someone said something to you that was kind of um, harsh or maybe the truth, it's because you took it on board that way. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to be very, very careful about the way I'm explaining this right now. And it's all about the way you react to it. Okay, so no one can actually make you feel sad. No one can actually make you feel hurt. No one can actually make you feel happy. It all comes from within, right? You could be having the greatest day. You could be in the greatest state. But if someone actually said something to you harshly, if it meant something to you, you would then feel sad because you're drawing it to a feeling that you had. If you were happy and you were in a great state and you were feeling emotionally awesome and someone said something to you that was actually quite hurtful and mean, if it had nothing to do with you or it didn't mean anything to you, you would carry on being happy and carry on being in an emotional state of happiness. Does this make sense? I know it does, so I'm just sharing with you, right? So no one can actually make you feel anything. No one can actually make you feel bad for what you're doing. No one can actually make you feel happy for what you're doing. That comes from within. So your reactions, this is just threading in so much about how your reactions are your feelings. Your feelings are your reactions. And what you tie back to that is entirely up to you. You cannot, you cannot blame others for anything that is happening with your own feelings because they are yours. Now, this is the biggest spin-off about this, is that we all still need to be mindful of other people's feelings because we never know what they're going through in a day. We never know what they've gone through at night. We only see them for the moment that we see them. This is why it is extremely precious that when we get time with these people, whether you're just passing them down by the street and saying hello, whether you get to have a coffee with them, is that you don't bring your problems to them unless they're close enough for you that you open up the conversation to have that conversation with. Be mindful of the way they feel and remember that you want to make the most of every moment you spend with that person. It doesn't matter if it's every day at home. It doesn't matter if they only get to see them after work, partner, friendship, relationship, children, whatever it is. Remember that they cannot make you feel any different than the what you're going to accept and then react to and vice versa. That's my handy little tip for today. I hope you guys are having an amazing Tuesday. Am I right? Peace out. PJ from Addicted to Growth.